Yo, what is up everyone? Welcome to another stream. Today, as you see in the background, I'll be reacting to the new uh, trailer that's coming out. Also, something I noticed in the previous stream was that my camera wasn't synced with uh, the audio. So I apologize for that. And also, hopefully, the green screen isn't that bad now. I saw... I, when watching a YouTube video, I saw some, how someone um, uh, does their green screen, aka Captain Sparkles, when he did his house tour. Basically, it just says that he closes the blind, so there's, con there's the same constant light. And you can have the same constant setup. For his uh, filters and stuff, so yeah, I took it. I took that into account. So right now I'm just using the house lights, and then oh yeah, on top of that, later on today or after this, the my world of Chell video is over. I'll be taking a short break and then coming back. To do this, bada bing, bada boom. The Bean Boozle Fiery Five Challenge, which has Sriracha, Jalapeno, Cayenne, Habanero, and Carolina Reaper. They have, and it's just like a challenge where you spin it. There's no chance of it being something else like their previous challenges. Like the regular beam boozled one. And I have done this before. I did it in, um, uh, I did this for the 400 subscribers mark in the thank you video. So. If you, if you, if you think that's. It's familiar, then that's why. So. That's where it was previously seen. The reason why I'm doing it now is because... Uh, I'm doing it now is because... But I mean, but I mean, I'm gonna replay the notifications because they were, I wasn't here when the, these notifications played. If I know how to. All them. Not letting me replay it. I guess you can only play it once per stream. And that's why I tried doing it. Okay, well, anyways, thank you so much, fam underscore chaos, for the follow. Jared underscore, thank you for the follow as well. Um, um, and then that's when I reached my follower goal of 120. And then, last but not least, Blake69, thank you for the follow. Oh yeah, and also thank you, Bill through Y, for the shout out. Much appreciated. Oh no, I think it's delayed again. Something's wrong with my audio. I fucked up the settings. This is what happens. Hello? Yo. Uh, hi, hello. Okay. Maybe that's what did it. It's because what I realized is that... It's what I realized is that, um, uh... I'm not using my full capability of my camera right now. And for this stream, I kind of just decide, okay, you know, I'll just go back to the default settings. Right now, it seems I'm in sync again. There's like some of a delay, but it's not that bad. No. So yeah, my ex expectations for this video, this, uh, this, yeah, this World of Chell trailer. I don't really have that many because World of Chell is something 
I barely played, I only really played it when it got first introduced. And then that was it. So. And that was like in a technical test that I played it. So, I don't really have that high up of expectations. We'll see what happens. Maybe this brings me back. I guess we'll see. There's two more minutes remaining. All well, three, actually, but whatever. So. I guess it's two minutes until it does the premiere screen thing. So, yeah. <laughs> However, for my, I'll just say my expectations for the game then. Um, uh, so for the game, my only expectations are really, I'm hoping, well, my wish list actually, sorry. My wish list is that there's actually a new mode or something, like a new sub modes maybe to the game. It's not just the last, it's not like the last 10 games or five games or whatever. It's not, I'm just hoping it's not just a reskin and like adding more players to the roster and sort of deal. Like, I guess a DLC. Slash a bug patch. So I'm hoping it's not just that. I'm hoping there's actually like some new stuff to it. It's not just, oh, look at this. Um, uh, we added new mechanics because that's what it seems to be so far. I'm, uh, I'm hoping with this this world of chill, it's like, okay, we're just doing this trailer for this one today. And then another day we'll have another trailer for the new for new stuff that comes to this mo other mode. And then all of a sudden, whoa, surprise new mode. We got wishlist. I'm hoping in franchise mode, there's actually like, you get to see your players' achievements once they retire, other than their points, goal, and assists, and all that stuff, their stats. I hope, what I mean by achievements is if how many Stanley Cups they won in their career, how many trophies they won, like Vesna's and like Conn Smythe and uh, all the above. And also maybe what position their team went into each year just see how they did compared to how their team did i know it's a big ass but it would be pretty awesome to see that so i know I, I some youtubers i watch when they do they're like oh look how uh, let's do a franchise mode simulation of a player they have to add up all the stuff in the end Oh yeah, and also next after this it's gonna be intro. Oh, it's starting. Let me mute my uh, Nintendo music. Oh. Oh no, not my light! Of course, all this stuff goes to shit. <laughs> but yeah, that's what I'm hoping. But yeah, once this trailer's over, we'll go over it again. I won't speak for the first viewing of it, I'll just do a reaction type of deal. And then after, once this trailer is over, we're going to go over it. So the first thing is just my hey reaction. Everyone, I'm Mike Inglehart, and welcome to the NHL 24 World of Chell Deep Dive. Let's get into it. Full crossplay has arrived this year, and that means you can now team up with and against friends across your respective console generation. Crossplay will be available across Hockey Ultimate Team and all World of Chell modes, Ooh. meaning more people to play with and shorter waiting times to jump into games. Our new matchmaking setting lets you choose if you'd like the remaining spots in your roster to be filled out by free agent human players. This means if you don't have enough skaters online, you can still squat up, earn rewards for your club, 
and potentially find new teammates all at the same time. Based on feedback from the community, we've revamped the EA Sports Hockey League playoff structure to one similar to what you'd see in the NHL playoffs. You'll now play through four best of seven series on your path to a championship. No more having to play what seemed like hundreds of games to have a chance. Every game will now carry higher stakes than ever before. And if you're good enough to win it all, get ready to enjoy a proper cup celebration alongside your teammates when you become champs. Plus, we've added a new casual 3v3 mode, offering a low pressure, quick and easy way to play a game or two with your buds without committing to games that will affect your EA Sports Hockey League standing. We've overhauled and vastly improved the speed at which you can now utilize Creation Zone. Now with just the press of a button, you can make changes quick, fast, and prompt, making the avatar you desire. Unlike previous nice. times, you now have the expansive use of Creation Zone visible on one screen and can now easily Ooh, find them jerseys. and create the persona you want to bring to the ice. You also now have the ability to save multiple presets of your favorite look, ensuring you can diversify your appearance on oh, the yeah. ice anytime you'd like. The Yager the community look, spoke and we listened. We've replaced oh, the no. mechanic and implemented entirely new ways to earn exactly no. the and get your rewards when you want them. They that got battle pass, bro. Pass. You can Welcome to Fortnite. And through 75 tiers bro, this looks like each Fortnite. Season. Each battle pass includes a free and premium tier, with all players getting access to premium for season one. You'll be able to earn things like player Fortnite value, NHL player mode. Classes, celebrations, banners, and gear for your club. Any gameplay specific unlocks, like custom player classes, will always be available for everyone through the free tier. Not only does it make the gameplay experience more balanced, but really puts the focus on choosing and unlocking new ways to play. As we say goodbye to hockey bags, we're excited to introduce the World of Chell store, where you can get the items you want when you want them. Here, you can easily use World of Chell coins to get specific unlocks for your player or club. The World of Chell store gives direct Bro, I have so many coins that I haven't really used. Want, and most items you collect will carry over to NHL 25 so you can continue to flex your favorite fit. From full cross I want my coins from NHL 23. To more opportunities to earn rewards and get creative with your character and crew, we hope you're as excited as we are about all the new stuff cooked up for World of Chow and NHL 24. Thanks for tuning in and can't wait to see you on the ice. Interesting. So I'm gonna pre-order the X Factor Edition. That's it. <laughs> Alrighty. So, hopefully, I didn't just ruin everything here. Oh, yeah, I did. Hey, it's the hockey guy. <laughs> okay, refresh. Give me. That's it. Hey, oh, everyone, it says I'm NHL 20. Oh, no. How did I? Where did I press Steam? Okay. It actually loaded for a second there. Hey everyone, I'm Mike Hillard. Hey, there you go. Boom. Crank that shit to 4K because the never, uh, never mind, not 4K because he'll just kill the stream to 1080. Hey everyone, I'm Mike Englehart and welcome to the NHL 24 World of Chell Deep Dive. Let's get into it. Full crossplay has arrived this year, and that means you can now crossplay still is pretty cool. Team up with and against friends across your respective console generation. Crossplay will be available across Hockey Ultimate Team and all world. Now look at this sick mode. This is actually, uh, I like this screen. It looks like a dark mode type of deal. Across Hockey Ultimate Team. And then also it's not just some random game, some fake game play. Ultimate Team and all. It's like, I mean, this is McDavid, but I like this better. And also, there's the for you off online, offline, and more. 
Okay. Damn, we all got them for you pages now. Oh, and I see that you can queue up here with your other teammates right here. Behind where... Let me move my me for a second. Basically. Wait, do I not have... Mouse on? Okay, I do. What the heck? It's not just... It, it's not showing it. Okay. So anyways... At the bottom right corner, you see, there's a icon thing where you can see um uh, where I guess where you, other players can queue up. Yeah, that's something I want to point out. I guess you can still be in your lobby in a lobby while outside of the online mode. I guess. Yeah, there's that stuff. All world of Chell. No, it'd be awkward if World of Chell was not recommended here. Need more people to play with and shorter waiting times to jump into games. Oh, wait, maybe the generation crossplay will be available across Hockey Ultimate Team and All World of Chell modes, meaning more people to play with and shorter okay. waiting times to jump into games. Our new matchmaking setting lets you choose if you'd like the remaining waiting no, times to back. jump into games. Our Let me see what modes there is here. Oh, yeah, so threes is what I played. Or, uh, uh, ones. Ones is what I played. Which is basically you against three, uh, two other people. And it's like, you're, it's like half the of an arena. Like, it's only like a zone. And then you're just like trying to get into the net. And then once you, you score, you just the puck lands in the middle. And then it's just all out chaos. But yeah, so there's that. It's just, I don't play as much because I end up matching up with like people are way better than me and and it's it's bad news after that. So yeah, and then I see this like quick play three v three, ECHL. Yeah, it's ranked. Yeah, this looks like freaking Fortnite now. Matchmaking setting. You got your loadouts, your clubs. Oh, I don't know. Never mind. They don't have clubs, but they have the cup. My is battle pass. <laughs> Your you stats. Choose, if you'd like the remaining in the, spots in the V Buck store, to be filled out by free agent human players. This means if you don't have enough skaters online, you can still squat up, earn rewards for your club. Man, this guy one v three with computers. At the same time. Based on feedback from the community, we've revamped the EA Sports Hockey League playoff structure to one similar to what you'd see in the NHL playoffs. You'll now play through four best of seven series on your path to a championship. No more having to play what seemed like hundreds of games to have a chance. Every game will now carry higher stakes than ever before. And if you're good enough to win it all, get ready to enjoy a proper cup celebration alongside nice. your teammates when you become champions. I didn't even know if there wasn't Plus, one We've added before. a new casual 3v3 it's mode, nice. offering a low-pressure, quick and easy way to play More a game stuff. or two with your buds without committing to games that will affect your EA Sports Hockey League standing. We've overhauled and vastly improved the speed at which you can now utilize Creation Zone. Now with just the press of a button, it's the Fortnite you can make customization quick, screen. fast, and prompt, making the avatar you desire. Unlike previous titles, you now have the expansive use of Creation Zone visible on one screen and can now easily- I like all these, like, jerseys and stuff. They're not just all the- the normal ones. Easily find, edit, and create so this would be cool in the NHL to have jerseys like this. You also like now this. have the ability to save multiple presets of your favorite look, ensuring you can diversify your appearance on that the ice look. anytime you'd like. The community spoke, and we listened. We've replaced we, the, the community spoke and they want a bell pass. Damn. And entirely new ways to earn exactly Guess it's better than loot boxes. And get your rewards when you want them. That starts with our all new battle pass. You can now play and progress through 75 tiers of rewards each season. Each battle pass includes a free and premium tier. Oh yeah, they got emotes. Well, I mean, to that's always been a thing. One. You'll yeah. be able to earn things like player vanity, player classes, celebrations, banners, and gear for your club. Any gameplay specific unlocks like custom player classes. Yes, emotes in real life are actually a thing in sports. Tier. Not only does it make the gameplay experience more balanced, but really puts the focus on choosing and unlocking new ways to play. Experience more how a real Canadian, how a Canadian dresses up to go play hockey in the in the winter. Balanced, but just in their plaid PJ 
bottoms and a uh, jean coat and a tube. Really puts the focus on choosing and unlocking new ways to play. As we say goodbye to hockey bags, we're excited to introduce the world of Chell's store, where you can get the items you want when you want. Yeah, that's Here, actually a very good you can addition. Use world of Chell coins. I don't to know why that wasn't a thing before. For your player or club. The World of Chell store gives direct access to the vanity items you really want. And most items you collect will carry over to NHL 25. So you can continue to flex your favorite fit. From full crossplay, a refreshed casual mode, to more opportunities to earn rewards and get creative with your character and crew, we hope you're as excited as we are about all the new stuff cooked up for World of Chell in NHL 24. Mm -hmm. Thanks for tuning in. I can't wait to see you on the ice. All right. Yeah, I don't really have anything other than that to say. Uh, I didn't really play World of Chell as much, so the only times I played is when there was threes, and then and then ones was introduced. I remember when three was first introduced, I heavily gamed that, and same went once. But uh, threes, I, I did the whole campaign mode of it, and that was fun. Yeah. So yeah, well, I'll be. So I'm gonna go grab some uh, my stuff for. Oh, what the heck? What the heck happened here? Oh, you get to see my subscriptions and stuff now. <laughs> Why is like half the thing cropped? Just casually fixing my screen now. Alrighty, well, thank you, thank you all for watching this Chell mode uh, reaction, World of Chell mode reaction trailer, whatever, my live reaction to the World of Chell trailer. And as always, stay safe and wear a helmet and stick around for now a. 120 followers celebration so we'll be right back bruh no don't no come on use your your ball what are you doing my man's trying to eliminate him oh mlg plays right there <laughs> Which is probably like a minute and a half. Oh, we're having a fight now. One punch. One freaking punch. What are you doing? Come on. What the fuck are you doing? Are you bloody fuck? Really? What the fuck? That's it. Are you fucking Say hello to my little friend! The Canadians take possession here in the open ice. Fires it! Big save by the goaltender watching that one. Wow. Yes! <laughs> this is what Santa Man wanted us to watch. I know. I, I, just, I just found a random video was going through YouTube when the movie was going on. I'm like, what the fuck is this? I gotta share this. Well, now we're watching it. Are you watching it? I don't see it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the video's not playing for me. Oh, he got shot! <laughs> Sonic.exe?